three, two, one, Raptor report. Well, a day of buildup only to end in disappointment. The SpaceX Starship test aborted literally, as you just saw, at the very last second. Hello and welcome to CBS 4 Valley at 6. I'm Chris Jacobs. And I'm Faith Woodard. SpaceX says it is standing down for today after aborting the high-altitude launch of its SN8 Starship. That launch drawing large crowds across the RGV with hopes of seeing that launch take place. CBS 4's Bryce Helms is live from South Padre Island to tell us more about what happened. Bryce. That's right. One of the Raptor engines signaled something right after that engine fired that prompted SpaceX to abort the launch with only one second left on the countdown. You know, that was disheartening for the large crowd that gathered here at Isla Blanca Park to watch history in the making. People were out here literally all day, some here even before 8 a.m. And though the wait was long for most of the day, the mood was optimistic, but that changed as soon as word came in that the launch was canceled. Well, we're a little bummed that the launch didn't happen today. Uh, we were really looking forward to seeing it. Uh, we had a great turnout on South Padre Island for, um, you know, the launch. And, you know, we'll come back again. We'll, we'll be back tomorrow and, and just uh, be on the lookout for the next launch. Starship SN8 was supposed to launch up to 50,000 feet into the sky. Instead, it never even left the ground. Now, SpaceX is saying they plan on trying again on Thursday, but there is no targeted launch time as of now. Working for you on South Padre Island, I'm Bryce Holmes.